Hello everyone, my name is Lil X6, and I have some extremely heartbreaking news for some, and some extremely good news for some others, if you know what I'm saying. But, uh, anyways, you read the title right, I got left by my what? Now, I know what you're thinking. You're like, oh, Lil XX, you're such a good-looking guy. How could your wife ever leave you? Well, uh, let's talk about it. So, basically, uh, I work, or I should say worked, at Arby's. I got fired yesterday. Yep, so not only did I lose my wife, but I also lost my job. It has not been a good last couple days for me. But, uh, anyways, yeah, I used to work at Arby's. And, uh, while I was working there, I guess I should specify, my job at Arby's was, uh, pretty much taking people's leftover food and eating it. Because, uh, the owners of Arby's, like, they didn't pay for, like, the garbage truck to come so yeah I had to eat the leftover food and like the plastic and stuff and like the wrappers they just burned it so uh yeah that's pretty much what I did and yeah as you guys can see I, I may or may not have put on a couple of pounds from that but uh the pay was really really good I got paid like seven dollars an hour which was a lot better from my previous job, so yeah, it was a really nice gig. But that's not what this story is about. This story is about a woman named Jolene. Oh, Jolene! Oh, but, eh, just forget about that. Um, but Jolene was, uh, let's just say, a very attractive 78-year-old woman. And, uh, she worked as a dishwasher in the back, and I would see her from time to time, because, you know, they'd bring the dishes back to her, and, like, I'd eat the food off of them before she washed them, so, you know, we kind of got close, and, uh, yeah, I got feelings pretty quickly, so, you know, I decided to ask her out. And the weird thing about it was she looked a lot, and I mean a lot, like my wife's grandma, at least from the pictures that I've seen. And another funny thing about it was that my wife's grandma, her name was Jolene too. I know, what are the odds? But anyways, I asked her out, and uh, she, she actually said yes, which I was like, Let's go, Lil X6, let's go, Lil X6, but uh, anyways, um, she said, you know, after work, meet me behind, uh, meet me behind the dumpster, so we can, you know, I know nothing, 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 but uh, yeah, she said, meet me behind the dumpster, and I was like, okay, here is my shot. So, uh, I said, oh yeah, so, uh, yeah, she said, meet me behind the dumpster, let me say, 4.30, because, uh, um, this Arby's closed at 4, for whatever reason, and we had to, like, clean up and stuff, so, 4.30 was about when we got done. So, 4.30 came, and I went out to the dumpster, and you are never going to guess who was there. My Lil XXing wife, to this day! I have no idea how she even knew about this, but she was behind the dumpster, and she said, I know you're here to meet Jolene, and, uh, I was, uh, I didn't know what to do, I was like, uh, uh, uh what, what? and then my boss came out, she was, he was, like, standing behind, like, the dumpster, and he, like, came out of the dumpster, almost, and he was like, you were here to meet Jolene? And, uh, I was like, I was froze. I didn't know what to do. And, uh, yeah, so basically from there, everything went down. And 
my wife left me, and my boss fired me, and, uh, this is where I am today. So, that is my humiliating story. Relaxa.